everybody so today I did this fun look you can do it for Dia de los Muertos you can do it for Halloween I thought it was so much fun I love skulls I love um, sugar skulls I just love skulls I love skulls and I did a sugar skull tutorial last year and I can link it down below and I wanted to do another sugar skull tutorial just because I really like sugar skull um, sugar skulls and it's pretty easy to do these looks this year I wanted to do like a glam highlight like old Hollywood type look with the bright red lip and super highlighted of course and then I also did half of my face with ya muerta so um anywho if you guys want to see how I got this look just please keep on watching my hair it's okay it's holding in there I don't have a tutorial for the hair I started filming it and then my camera died on me and I was afraid of losing light so I just quickly did my hair and finished the um which is the intro or outro I don't know I guess intro I'm doing intro now so anywho um, if you guys want a video on how I did this I can definitely um, do a video for you guys because it's actually pretty easy how to do this hairstyle but um, all I'm giving you guys in this video is going to be the makeup look I hope you guys like it if you guys are not subscribed and you like my channel please hit the subscribe button down below if you like this video please give it a thumbs up thank you guys so much for watching I hope you guys like the video have a great day bye you guys so I started off by priming my face and then I used foundation on half my face Maybelline fit me into 20 and Mac Pro Longwear in NC20 and I used a dry sponge to apply this then um, to set my face I used NYC smooth skin loose face powder in translucent I love this powder and then for my lid to set it I used Wet n Wild's creme brulee single eyeshadow then going with the L'Oreal nude palette I used the color number three on my crease as my transition color and then afterwards I went in with number six then I used the banana shade from the contour kit as my concealer then I used number nine on the lid and number eight as a crease color then I used broke down from the vice three palette on the lid then I just blended everything out and then I lined my lids with NYC liquid liner for lower lash line I use number three and number eight to define that line then I use number one for the inner tear duct and then I went in with pop champagne from Becca just to brighten up as contour I used fawn from the Anastasia contour kit Then for bronze and blush, I use both the bronzer and the blush from the Naked on the Run Urban Decay palette, my favorite of all time. For cheekbone highlight, I use Becca again, Pop Champagne, and then I added some mascara to my top and bottom lashes. And then for face paint, I use Snazaru. Just go softly with it. I put too much, and so a little at a time would be better than adding that giant chunk that I did right there and then I just smoothed that out then I set it with Laura Mercier Universal Invisible Powder and then I outlined my eye socket with a black liner then I made a crisper line with a thinner black eyeliner and then I colored in my lid with a red eyeshadow from NYX this is from the Femme Fatale eyeshadow palette I went back in with the thick eyeliner to thicken up the black line 
And then I set it with LBD from the Anastasia Amrezi palette. Then I found these cool um, drop shaped gemstone tattoos that I applied um, just on my on the black portion of my eye. Then using the thin black liner again, I drew little petals all around my eye, which then I filled in with the red eyeshadow from NYX from earlier. Then using the thin liner again, I outlined what I thought was like my jaw socket area and um, then I colored it in with a black eyeshadow. Um, halfway down, I feel like I made it too thick and I messed up, which was okay. I just, like right there it was too thick, so I just added some snazaru on top just to fix my boo-boo and start all over again. Then for the teeth, I used um, black eyeshadow and a very thin um, brush just to draw out the details of my teeth. I thought this looked pretty cool actually. And then I colored it in with the tan eyeshadow called Vanilla from the Emirati palette. So this is pretty much the whole skull look. Then I lined my lips with a lip liner from Essence called Femme Fatale and I colored it in. And then I used a liquid lipstick by Kat Von D in the color Outlaw. Sorry if my mirror did cover up a lot of my work, but like I said, I just lined my lips and then colored them in. And then after this, I am going to apply eyeliner off camera to my skull side and also lashes and then you'll see the final look. So this is the finished look. You guys did see my look in the intro, but I also wanted to show you guys in case you guys wanted to see La Muerte or Sugar Skull and the glam look. Bye you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching.